YouTubers, my name is Nathan and you're watching Robot Masters. Today we got the spot clean of the Roomba S9. I just want to give a quick thanks to all your friends and families to allow you to watch a quick video of the spot cleaning. So stay tuned, I gotta go, see ya! So we're gonna first start out with cleaning out the Roomba S9. I'm gonna vacuum out the dustbin and vacuum out the filter as well. Please pay no attention to the green dinosaur on the right. He's perfectly fine. He's just sleeping right now. So if you haven't checked out my other individual spot clean test with the Roborock S5, I highly recommend you do so. Spoiler alert, the Roborock S5 did really well. It got a 99.5% cleanup test. So basically, it only scattered around 0 0.005 ounces of debris. I will go ahead and link that video down in the description. I am also going to clean up the floor as well, just do a quick vacuum job to make sure there isn't any leftover granola from my previous testing. So I figured the best way to get the most accurate reading is to weigh the dry empty weight of the dustbin. So I can get a pretty accurate measurement by measuring the before and after weight of the dustbin. So the scale I'm using is from Vitamix, it's a Bluetooth scale. It also can pair up with the blender. It's a great setup. You can make smoothies, soups. It's a really awesome machine. I highly recommend you guys check out the Vitamix blender. So I'm going to measure out one ounce of granola. So I have to tear out the glass. This way I'm only measuring the granola and not the actual glass container. So I've been talking with a lot of YouTubers these days and I actually wonder where are you guys living? Uh, are you guys out of state? Do you guys live here in the US? I'm actually from Colorado and we have pretty crazy weather. Just the other day it was a snowstorm basically. It was a lot of hail and fog. So here's another thing I would like to know in the comments. What's the reason why you like to watch my YouTube channel? What makes my YouTube ch channel stand out from the rest? Is it because of my crazy intros or do you just like the informative information I provide. The reason I'm asking this is I would like to get your guys point of view of how you guys view my channel. I know there's a lot of robot vacuum reviewers out there and a lot of them do a really good job so I'm trying to make my channel stand out from the rest. Okay I hope I'm not talking your ear off. We're finally getting to the good part which you guys are all wanting to see. The spot clean test of the Roomba S9. So let me just go ahead and briefly tell you why the S9 is going to do so well on this test. One, is it has the best suction of any robot vacuum. The airflow on this Roomba is 22 CFM, which is the highest of any commercially available robot vacuum to date. Also, the side brush compared to the i7 has been improved vastly, so it's not going to scatter the debris as much as on the Roomba i7. The last thing that the Roomba S9 has gone for is the lower extractor height so it can able to get closer to the ground to provide that really strong suction. So just listen to the sound of the Roomba S9. It sounds really cool like it's about to take off or something. So it did it pretty good not to scatter too much debris. Just from looking at the results I don't see that many grains of granola on the ground. So like the Roomba i7 it will start out in a spiral pattern slowly moving outwards and then once it reach the maximum diameter it will start spiraling back in towards the center. I think this is a pretty efficient way to spot clean. So if you like this video please smash the like button it really helps me gauge if this video is interesting. Also if you haven't done so please subscribe to my channel. I provide daily updates on these new cool robot vacuums. I'm probably one of the few channels that does this. I also do unboxings, reviews and I'm also going to get the Roborock S6 shortly. So I also created a playlist to my YouTube channel. There's different categories like in-depth reviews, unboxings, overviews. I also do extreme testings, normal testings. I also do some funny videos as well. So go ahead and check out my playlist to see if you can find a type of video you're looking for. With that out of the way, let's go ahead and check out the results. This is the moment of truth. Can the S9 beat out the Roborock? S5 and also can it beat out the sibling i7. Just wait for it, that number is going to go up, there you go, 
12.23 ounces. So basically, it achieved better than 100%, 101% score. That's just mind-blowing amazing. So here's what the dustbin looks like. Basically, it looks like everything was picked up and even more.